Welcome to No Excuses. My name is Mary Fran, and this is my place to come talk about weight loss, fitness, life, everything, because I want to be the best me possible. And that does include a 100 plus pound weight loss effort that is about midway through. So let's get to it. If you are new here, like, subscribe, comment, do all of the above. I really enjoy the interaction, so thank you very much. It has been so hot lately, and I know I've talked about ways to do things inside, but I just like to be outside. And Jason and I both like to be outside, but the heat has kept us away from biking and hiking. And this weekend, we decided to stop. So we went out and we braved the heat. On Saturday, we went to the Little Bennett Regional Park. It was really hot, but we wanted to just get out and see what was happening. So we went there, we hiked for about an hour, hour and a half, and we found some amazing berries that were still straggling, so I was surprised I got to eat some. And we hiked, and we felt really, really good. So on Sunday, we were feeling really bold and confident because we had hiked for about an hour or so. So we decided to go hiking on Sunday also. And we spent some time thinking about what in the world we could actually do and where to go. And I did a little bit of research. And I decided that we were going to go to Weaverton Cliffs. Now, I had never been to Weaverton Cliffs. And so I did a little bit of research and I realized that it was uphill and it was steep switchbacks and a little rocky. And I was like, yes, this is awesome because I am going to be able to use my new trekking poles. I was right, it was rocky. is quite rocky. It was also uphill with some really steep switchbacks along the way. We did see people taking shortcuts from switchback to switchback instead of going the lung, just going straight up, even though there were signs posted saying prevent erosion. And I see why they have to have the sign there because you can see the trail is right there. We have been switchbacking steep switchbacks. If you look close, you can see one trail there came around and one trail down there. So we are on some steep ass switchbacks. In fairness, we did also see a couple with two young kids. And I noticed as the father went by the sign for preventing erosion, he stopped and read the sign to his son and he explained the sign. And about two or three minutes later, the mother comes by with another young kid. And when I say young, I mean probably three, four. And she stopped at the sign, read the sign, and explained it to her son. Now, the son made me laugh because he's like, but I like to explore. But she explained why not. And I was so impressed with those parents because they're trying to help save our world. We made it to the top, of course. So we are at the top, or close to the top at least. Here is where we are going to go to Weaverland, Weaverton Cliffs, that away. Or we could go to the Appalachian Trail, that away. That was a pretty nice climb. It was all rocky. I was using my lucky trekking poles. And so far, so good. I'm really liking them. And of course, we went the short distance to the Overlook. And the overlook was pretty awesome to see. And once we were on the overlook, we just hiked back down. And it was a good hike. It was hot but it was good and it was fun and we are so glad that we did it and we plan to go again next weekend hopefully that was a neat hike to weaverton cliffs i use the trekking poles and i think they are going to be an amazing addition because i did stumble once or twice the extra stability that the poles gave me i was solid as a rock and just breezed right on up that hill and breezed right on down it 
well maybe not a breeze because it is hot you can see how red my face is it was stinking hot but we had a great time and the overlook tonight looked nice so now we're just gonna go head out and check out some stuff in Harper's Ferry see what we can see just kind of explore the rest of the day cool down a little bit and who knows it is hot but we have decided that there are no excuses and we still got out, we still went hiking and we still had a great time. No excuses.